Star Pass 3 billion US dollars within 2021. Billion US dollars the Commerce Minister expressed hope while the addressing a press briefing expressed his after a meeting with Canadian High Commissioner in Dhaka, Benoit Prefontaine, at his ministry office today. Commerce Secretary Shubhashish Boshu was also present, mentioning that Bangladesh is developing 100 special economic zones. Benoit Prefontaine termed Bangladesh's investment environment and as excellent and hoped Canadian investors would come up with investment in Bangladesh. Home Minister Asaduzzaman Khan Kamal has said the government is working to free country from terrorism, drugs and robbers to achieve sustainable development goals, SDGs. He said this in a surrendering program of forest robbers at Lobunchar of Khulna district today. 57 members, including chiefs of six forest robber gangs in were present among others. The minister said young generation should be protected from drugs to implement Vision 2021 and Vision 2041. He informed that at the directives of Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina's campaign against drugs is being run throughout the country. Now international news. U.S. President Donald Trump has said there is a very substantial chance a historic summit with North Korea's Kim Jong-un next month may not happen. He said the North must meet conditions for the summit to go ahead, though if it did not, it might happen later. Trump was speaking as he received South Korea's President Moon Jae-in at the White House. The North has said it may cancel the summit if the U.S. insists on it giving up nuclear weapons unilaterally. Russian President Vladimir Putin and Prime Minister Narendra Modi had very intense discussions on bilateral and global issues that would provide the guidelines for the further development of India-Russia special privileged strategic ties. Prime Minister Modi said the strategic partnership between India and Russia has now been elevated into a special privileged strategic partnership which is a very big achievement as he met President Putin in this Black Sea coastal city for the first informal summit to discuss a range of bilateral topics including defense cooperation as well as global issues of common concern. President Putin have also described the relationship with India as a special privileged strategic partnership which is a very big achievement in itself. Coming back to national news, Senior Assistant Editor of the Daily Kaler Konto, Mohammad Kamaluddin, has been buried at Mirpur Intellectuals Graveyard in the capital after Asr prayers today. Earlier, his first namaz janaza was held at the National Press Club after Zohar prayer. Information Minister Hassan.